Hey, what's happening? And how you all doing? Power to the bus here. And I just got the Lightning Collection of Tommy. And, well, off the back, mine's head is, like, loose. Wobbly. I took the head off to put on the Tommy head. Which, again, out of all of them, this one was the only one with the best paint. I feel like his forehead sticks out a little bit too much on this angle. I don't know. It is just me. But the one I have held at Target has better paint apps. So this one might go to my son and I'll keep that one or vice versa. But yeah, um, off the back, this is the best Tommy figure we ever got. I don't have an SH figure art, which to me personally, um, I didn't really care for. Uh, I got rid of mines. And yeah, this is a better compromise. So here is what we've received in Tommy's. This one I did not open, uh, as you can see, but it's essentially the same figure as the uh, Action Hero one. It was just twenty bucks. Man, I can't believe I actually spent that. And this was ten bucks. And. As you can see, it's the same figure. Uh, just some gold here and there. Uh, let's see if I can get it to. So yeah, and this one actually my son's. He's <laughs> he's the one who's been playing with this one. Mine's is still in the package and uh, with my other Power Ranger figures. Uh, let's see. Um. Actually, that, these came with the Action Hero ones. That's what it was. And, yeah, I have mine with my Six Rangers from my uh, Super Mega Force line. Here's the OG. Big bulky. Uh, fun. Better than uh, these. Because, although I like these, kind of, they don't have bicep swivel or even a elbow swivel. Or thigh cut, or um, hinge and pivot ankles. So, yeah, they got worse. This is when they was on a A game, but still, you know, could you get some pretty good pose out of these guys? So, I don't have um. Oh, and now his shield starting to become like the Green Ranger I got. I don't have his Saba out to compare, but it's it's a standard Saba, just all gray. Uh, I couldn't find it. <laughs> it's in like a bin of other toys. And this video, I literally just decided to up and make. I'm not going to really show you guys the movie one because the costume is so different. It's pointless. But it's here. Uh, the Sabas. So, okay, this is the Legacy one. This is the Lightning one. And this is the movie Saba because the Saba technically is the same all around. <clears throat> I like the gold on the uh, legacy ones, but the black, I believe, is inaccurate here. I like this one the best, but this one has a silver face when it should be white, and they didn't color the eyes red. So, uh, you know, I mean, I could just take a, a marker and poke two dots in there and make that red. But let's see if I get it to close up here. I mean, it's not bad. This one is definitely the best so far. It just need better colors. So, oh, also the length, as you guys can see right there. Um, Am I missing one? I feel like I'm missing one that should be here. Well, if I am, oh well. Uh, yeah, there that was that. So, the uh, legacy one, good figures, but I don't know. I just I figured they would never complete the line. They were starting to slack inconsistencies and all this. You guys know all that from my previous videos, and it was always like bow legged to a point that you could rotate the. <laughs> boot and the foot and get your own 
way of standing, and it's like it shouldn't be that way. And all I never had a good feeling about these uh, ball wrists, but overall, it was still a good figure. Um, the best figure we got from them in terms of uh, articulation and everything. This was the definitive Bandai Power Ranger figure. Look at that, sick. Um, matter of fact, I wonder if he could get the pose that I got this White Ranger in now. Yeah, see, this ball is pretty loose. It actually was getting loose before. They didn't give us a second pair of hands with these guys or anything. Yeah, he he can't do that. He just looked like he's saying my wrist hurt. So, <laughs> there's no butterfly joint or anything, so... Yeah, pretty uh, limited, but okay for Bandai. This, I guess this was Bandai's uh, best, even though they came up with excuses for every little thing as if they was pioneering the way. But this is what I always wanted. When Marvel Legends first came out, and even down the line, I always thought, why can't we get a Marvel Legends version of Power Rangers? And it took so long, but we finally got it, guys. So, head rotate again. Mine's loose, so uh, left, right, uh, goes up pretty good. Uh, down pretty good. Uh, you got a butterfly joint in here, also, which is loose on mine. This is just a all around loose figure. See. I'm pretty sure it's not universal, but I would hope not. <laughs> but because again, this is like the hundredth review of this guy, so yeah. Uh, bicep swivel, arms go out, up and down. Even though I didn't do it just now, but yeah, out, up and down. Uh, hand swivel and hinge. This is the default one, which is chopped. Double elbow. Uh, no torso articulation but it does have a diaphragm joint which works pretty good which I actually prefer over a torso uh well waist swivel rather uh torso crunch which works awesome in out up and down uh thigh cut double knee joint uh boot cut uh pivot and hinge foot and yeah and technically I don't recall hearing no one else mention this because I've seen a couple reviews on this guy. But this is a loose piece. I don't know if there's a diamond under there or not, but get this thing to straighten up. But theoretically, I'm not going to do it, but you could cut this, or I might do it. I don't know. You could cut these and take the head off and then take the shield off and then customize it to whatever ranger. And then that way you could put it on and off at will. So, remember, you heard it here first, I think, unless someone else mentioned it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, guys, that's pretty much it. This is what we've been needing for, like, ever, and we finally got it. Uh, I like this one's head sculpt the best, but this is the figure. SH Figure Arts. Again, never got into it, so it was a pass for me because um, I bought a couple, and I didn't like them. They was too thin and fragile, so had to go. So, yeah. Uh, also, he comes with these effects, if I didn't show, that I'm not going to use, likely, and extra pair of hands. So, like, share, comment, subscribe. Uh, let me know what you guys think. I will catch you guys in the next one. Power to the Buster. Out.